Hi guys, I just want to come on and show you little baby Mateo. He had his earrings removed and here's his wavy curly hair and he has this cute little sleep sack with elephants on. I know the flash is probably making him look shiny but he's not like that in person. So I'm just gonna put his little hat back on. So there is Mateo as a boy. He came to me as a girl. He's just a cute little cuddle bug. So we're gonna put him over here because we have to do a introduction slash changing video of someone else who is hiding under this blanket. So let me move this forward. I'm still kind of deciding on a name for this girl. But there she is, crazy hair and all. She's like, oh, forget. I got like crazy hair going on. She's an Asian sculpt. And I believe she is Jolly, yes, but she is not the Adrian Stoltz Jolly, because I have that one. Um, I can't remember her sculptor's name, but she definitely needs to get changed. As you can see, when I redid the nursery, I realized she was still in a Valentine's dress. Poor little girl. So, she needs to get changed and get her hair done. So, I said, well... I might as well do a video of changing her. That way everyone can see her. And maybe help me try and decide on a name for her. So, the outfit I picked out, even though we're in Vermont and it's fall here, it's September, end of September. I don't know if it's from these crazy storms that like Florida's heat and everything is pushing up this way. But we're having like 85 to 90 degree days. I mean, <laughs> everybody's took down their pools, took their air conditioners out, everything, and then we get this heat front. Thankfully, I had left my air conditioner in, one of them at least, and my fans out so that, I mean, last week I had heat on, that tells you, so... It's just been crazy unusual, and I don't know what it's going to do to our fall foliage season. Because normally we need a pretty good cold snap for the leaves to turn and change color and fall off the trees eventually. So, she has these little red footing little poofy things on. I might leave those on to match this outfit. But I saw this outfit, well, this onesie would go perfect with this jumper. And I just love Oshkosh overalls and everything anyways. But it's an Oshkosh. Went shopping in my own closet, let's put it that way. <laughs> it's an Oshkosh, like, corduroy little floral. This is Oshkosh girl on the front. I don't know what size it oop didn't mean to whip that thing over. It's nine months, but it doesn't look like a nine months. It'd be a very short dress on a nine month. I mean she's I'd say a zero to three months, but a chubby zero to three months, so I couldn't imagine a nine month old child trying to they'd have to be like a bean pole. Let's try and put this it's got little pockets in the front, so I might have to set her up to adjust where her shirt, well, Missy. So I have an Asian girl named Mei Ling, and I have another Asian girl named Truly. So I was talking to I think a friend of mine, and I was like, well, actually, my ex-boyfriend now. That's another story. 
yep, all on its own. But anyways, so, um, he actually bought her for me. He bought a lot of babies for me. So, oh well. Say, oh well. <laughs> There's her chubby little face. So anyways, I was, um, I know someone that, on the reboring, you know, YouTube, that has one named Yuki. So I was thinking about Suki, and uh, I didn't know. And then he said, um, Suling. And I just, I don't know, it just didn't, I love these wet brand brushes. It just didn't, you know, really... You know how a name just has to either fit or not fit. And they also make, um, what brand makes a baby brush. And I have this size and I have the adult size. And I use, I have another one just for myself, of course. And I actually just got one that has the skull print on it. Skull candy. It's a um, wet brush. This one's mine. But it has uh, the skull candy on it, which I thought was pretty cool. But ever since, I mean, I have really long hair. And ever since I found the wet brand brushes, I will not use anything else on their hair, my Masterpiece Dolls hair, or my hair. So I don't know if we're going to go with a little little curl. Say a little curl. So in the comments below, if you could think of an Asian name that you think she has such chub cheeks, such chub cheek cheeks, that would suit her. I know it's funny, my son was helping me pick up things from me changing a baby the other night and he's like, a toothbrush? <laughs> I said yes. He's like, that's strange. You couldn't imagine why I would use a toothbrush in their hair. I said, well, sometimes I did get a little hair bow out for her. Let's see if we can get this on without messing up your hair, little girl. Oh, great. I think I made it a little too small where it's going to slide. I think we did it. I think we did it. There we go. Now you just messed up my bangs, Mom. So you messed up my bangs. You messed up my top curl. There we go. Fix this on the side. Oops. Lift your head down a little bit to fix your bangs. Now the headband's going to crawl again. We just got a crawling headband. It's going to keep slide because you're an egghead. So I was not an egghead. So let's take a look at her. I love the little ruffle collar with this. She has these legs that just bend in. Like bow leg. She's like Miss Frog Legs. And they're like she would be a doll to sit on the shelf. But she just boop, bows them out. So don't lift up my skirty. Nope. See her legs are like <laughs> she just missed bow legs. She says that's because I like to sit my feet crisscrossed. Huh? Say crisscross applesauce. Crisscross applesauce. So if you could think of a name that you think might fit her and leave it in the comments below. And, uh, so there she is. I'm going to try and start doing, um, changings of the babies and, you know, on cam and, you know, show their, show them off, start sharing my collection. So, say bye-bye for now. Thank you very much and dolly hugs. 
and Mateo's over there snoozing. <laughs>